Hey you guys, it's me, your girl, Maya J. Thank you for watching and thank you for tuning in. I wanted to start the vlog off with a quick Fashion Nova try on haul because they just rung my doorbell with the package. So <laughs> I had to go ahead and, you know, try on what I had got. You guys know they had the 50% off um, sale, I guess for Black Friday last week. And I ordered, I made the order last, it couldn't have been last Friday, maybe last Wednesday, I'm not sure, but it just got here today and today's Tuesday. So it came pretty fast. And again, this came, well, everything that I got, I got it from their 50% off sale. So I just wanted to show you guys what I got. Um, so first I got these jeans, these straight leg jeans from Fashion Nova. They're pretty long on me. I'm 5'5", five five, so yeah, they're pretty long on me. But they're super comfortable nonetheless. They do hug my booty a little. I like the way they, they fit in. I like the way they fit in back there. So <laughs> I like the way they're fitting back there. Um, it's comfortable around my stomach as well. And then they're like a loose fit also. Um, so I like that. I wanted something, I didn't really want like a, um, what do you call it? The fitted, well, fitted jeans or whatever. I wanted something different because I always wear fitted jeans when I do wear fitted jeans. Um, so I wanted to get something different. So yeah, these are the straight leg jeans they had. And I got these for $19.99 and this is the medium wash. And then the pockets has like the little flap and it's real pockets y'all so love that just different so what i wanted to pair these jeans with i seen this cute sweater they had too so it's like a cropped sweater and it has the double zipper as well so i'm gonna go ahead and throw this on real quick and show you guys, cause I have an outfit idea that I wanna put together. I don't know where I'm gonna wear that yet, or I might just do like some IG pics or whatever. So, and y'all, this sweater is thick. So it's perfect for the winter time. Okay, so it's a little crop situation. And this is the collar here. And the sleeves come down pretty far. And this is the material. So it's pretty, pretty thick and cozy. And like I said, it does have the double zipper. So you can wear it like this. You can wear it zipped all the way up, or you can open it, oop, you can open it up top and at the bottom as well. So I'm gonna wear it like this, and I'm gonna also pair it with, I'm thinking about pairing it with my white A1s and these jeans. Can y'all get the vision? Y'all see the vision? <laughs> so I'm thinking about wearing it with the A1s, my white A1s, just to bring the white out in the sweater. And I am gonna pair it with um, silver accessories. Let me turn the light off. Ooh. So I got these from Fashion Nova as well. Like they had everything on sale. So I'm gonna pair it with this, with these earrings. And I have a, a, um, a silver purse picked out on Amazon that I'm gonna order to go with it. So I'm kind of going for like a sporty look, but kind of judge it up, dress it up a little bit. So I'm gonna wear these earrings and I have a silver purse that I'm gonna order off of Amazon. And I'm gonna wear my white um, sneakers with it. Or another option for shoes, 
I was thinking about some silver pointed toe heels um, just so they can be peeking out of the bottom of the jeans. I think that would be real cute too. So yeah, this is the fit. So it's a vision. Can y'all see the vision? <laughs> so it's a vision right now, but you know, when I put it all together, you know, I'm gonna come up here and show y'all. But yeah, I love this sweater, you guys. And I'm gonna link everything below as well. So I got the sweater in, let me take it off and see. I believe I got the sweater in a 2X. No. Oh no, I got it in a 3X. So it's the open book knit bomber. And I got it in a size 3X. And the jeans I got in a 22 plus because I got a stomach. I wanted to make sure, you know, I was able to button it and be comfortable. And you know, they are snug, but they're not too tight to where I can't breathe. I can still sit down and be comfortable. I'm comfortable now standing up in them. So they're pretty comfortable, but I got these in a 22 plus. And again, I got these earrings and I got these earrings as well from Fashion Nova. So they're like a, a paint drip kind of situation. So I'm going to wear these with another outfit. And I got those. Oh, and I bought a coat, y'all. I had bought a coat because I was like, you know, if I go somewhere and, you know, I'm, I'm dressed up, I want to have, you know, a coat to match and not just wear like a puffer coat or something like that. So, you know, I had got this um, pea coat here. And the material, I love the material, you guys. It feels so good. It feels so good, but guess what? It's too small. It's too small. Like they didn't give no arm, look at that. <laughs> they didn't give no arm room. Look at that. Look, and I got it in the biggest size, a 3X. They didn't give no arm room. Like I can wiggle my arm in there so it can come up, but I'm not about to do all of that. So what I did do was I let my mom try it on and the arms are a little too small for her, but she can still get it up comfortably because she's a little smaller up here in this area than I am. So it fits her pretty well. So she's gonna get it. <laughs> It's her coat and it has the pockets and it has the waist tie and it has the buttons as well. And the material is so soft and it's warm too, you guys. But the material, I love it. It feels so good. But unfortunately, it's too small for, for my arms. So that's all that I got from Fashion Nova. I didn't really see anything else that I was like, ooh, I gotta have it um, during their sale. So I just picked these up. I did want a good pair of jeans and I'm glad I got these. I'm glad they fit the way that they do. Um, so, and I love the pockets, y'all. I love that they have real pockets. But anyways, that's what I got from Fashion Nova. Again, I will leave the links in the bio if you know you did see something that you like. Um, so you can go up there and purchase it for yourself. But yeah, that's all I got. And I'm gonna get a coat to my mom. Call myself shopping for myself and end up shopping for her. Ugh. Okay, but anyways, I hope you guys are doing good. I just wanted to start the vlog off with a little mini fashion Nova haul. And I hope you guys have a good rest of the day. And I gotta get back to work, y'all. Bye.
good morning you guys so it's sunday i think i last tapped in with you guys on monday or tuesday when i started the vlog so my apologies i'm not making up any excuses we're here now so it's sunday morning well well it's 1201 so it's sunday afternoon so you guys see me make my balloon drink that i was showing you in the last vlog is like a supplement drink that you can take every day um and it's you're pretty much getting like your greens and your vegetables that you probably don't get um within all of the meals that you eat a day i'm not sure but it has all of those superfoods and pre and probiotics in that one drink and i drink that every morning so that's what you guys see me doing and you guys see me um cleaning my turkey wings because that's what we're gonna have for dinner today for sunday dinner so i'm gonna show you guys the seasoning that i use and how i season it and everything as well okay so i'm back and i poked holes in my turkey wings just so all the seasoning and everything can get down in there as it marinates so you guys see me clean it. I cleaned it with white vinegar and I also added a lemon as well just to make sure it's thoroughly cleaned. So we cleaned them and now we're about to season them. So first I always go in with black pepper. So I'm up. Never mind. That's not first. Sorry. <laughs> so first I always go in with olive oil. So I'm going to go in with olive oil and this just helps to spread the seasoning all over and to me it tenderizes the meat as well so i like to use olive oil first and then i'm just spray it back and before i get too into it i'm not gonna show well, I don't want to show a lot of the turkey wings before I cook them because, you know, some people, they get triggered by, you know, raw meat. So, and sometimes, honestly, I do get triggered by raw meat. So, that's why I didn't show much of me cleaning it because um, I don't want to trigger anybody. So, I'm not going to show the turkey wings before I cook them. Um, so, I'm going to just show you guys the seasoning that I make because if you like me... Sometimes I get triggered. I'm triggered now. <laughs> I'm triggered now. Okay. So the olive oil is spread all over. And then I also go in with some chicken broth. And I shook it up already. And I just pour a little bit over it. And kind of getting into the holes that we poked into. And the chicken broth helps with, you know, making the gravy and also tenderizing it as well. So I'm gonna just rub that in. Okay. All right, so now I go in with the black pepper. I'm a little low on black pepper. And the black pepper is not really for taste to me. Um, I just like to see my black pepper. <laughs> so, you know, you guys can use whatever seasoning you want. But first I go in with black pepper. Okay. And then I go in with my pollo seasoning. So this is at the bottom. So I'm going to just pour the rest of that, but I got another container. So I go in with pollo seasoning. Okay. And anytime y'all see me cook and y'all may say, oh, she ain't use enough seasoning or whatever. Y'all, I'm not trying to get high blood pressure <laughs> or anything else. So, you know, I try to I try to watch, you know, how much salt I use. So 
We use Pollo seasoning. And I am going to go in with some adobo. So this is the Badia adobo with complete seasoning. So I'm going to use just a little bit of that. And just because it has like, just for a little bit of color. And I like the taste of it as well. So I'm just going to use a smidge of that. Um, and then sometimes I add poultry seasoning. So I'm going to use a little bit of poultry seasoning. Okay. Some paprika for color. And I put Italian seasoning on everything, y'all. So we're going to add a little bit of Italian seasoning. I don't know what it is. <laughs> it don't really have a taste. I think I just like the, the herbiness of it and the look of it. But I put Italian seasoning on any and everything. Even my rice. Sometimes I put it in my rice. But... So now we got all the seasoning. So I'm going to just rub it in. Make sure you get all up in there. So these turkey wings, they're a little bit bigger than what I usually buy. I usually get my turkey wings if I do buy them and eat them. Um, I usually get them from Wegmans. Um, their turkey wings are always fresh and very pretty. So I always get them from Wegmans, but my aunt, she had some turkey wings and she gave some to me. So, and it's four of them. So I'm going to have some for today and tomorrow. Okay, and as y'all can see, I'm also using a plastic glove. So, okay, and they look good already, y'all. And they smell good. Okay. All right, so of course, what you do to one side, you gotta do to the other. All right. And at the bottom, it's already, that broth is at the bottom with the seasoning. So you're going to have a good gravy. But I'm not going to go in with olive oil and broth again. What I'm going to do is just go back in with my seasoning on the other side. Just so everything can have a nice color. So again, I'm low on black pepper. All right, so black pepper. I'm gonna go in with just a little bit more pollo seasoning. A smidge of the adobo. A um, little bit more of the poultry seasoning. Italian seasoning and paprika. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and mix these up and let them marinate for a few hours because I do have to go to the grocery store. So we might go to Whole Foods today. I don't need much. Um, just a few things. So we're going to go into Whole Foods and just, and I'm going to take a shower and get dressed. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do all of that. And we're going to go to Whole Foods and just get a few things um, that we need for the week. And these turkey wings, they'll be marinating while we're doing that. And 
I hope you guys are having a good Sunday or whenever you're watching this. And I'll catch up with you guys in a little bit. So it is the end of the night and we're ending it with the Dr. Jart Brightening Solution Mask. I'm finally using this. This is from the Sephora VIB sale video. I um, shared this with you guys. So if you didn't see that video, you can pause this video, go watch that one and come back and say goodnight. <laughs> so this is what I'm using for tonight. And we're going to see what it's hitting for. But yeah, so we had a long Sunday. As you can see, we started off with drinking our bloom. And we made some, well, I seasoned the turkey wings. Y'all seen me do that. And they were good, y'all. They were really good. It was late when they got finished because I had went to Whole Foods. So we went to Whole Foods first and got all of our, you know, essentials for the week you know, to help us go through the week with ease or a little bit more ease than usual. So you guys seen that. Um, like I said, I didn't get a lot. I didn't need much. Just the essentials um, that I was running low on or was out of. So you guys seen that. We went to Whole Foods and then we came back and I had put the turkey wings in the oven and stuff. So of course that took like I think they were in the oven for two hours, I believe. So it was a little late. So I went ahead and ate, child. I went ahead and ate and it was good. So I apologize for not showing it <laughs> to you guys. <laughs> I apologize for not showing, showing it to you guys, but just know that they were good. So I'm trying out, well, I'm kind of playing with the idea of making short form content. So I'm actually going to end the vlog here um, because I've been posting like longer videos, like close to an hour. So I kind of want to play around with posting videos that are like maybe 25 to 30 minutes. I'm not sure 
because I be feeling like I don't have a lot to do or I'm not doing a lot until I actually go and put all of the clips together and edit the video. So it's like, I be thinking I don't have a lot, but it adds up to like an hour and some change until I edit it down and it's still like 50 minutes or whatever. So I kind of want to play around with that idea. Um, so if you guys have any suggestions or, you know, just let me know what you guys think about the short form content as well. So I'm going to play around with that. And this video might be, I don't know how long it's going to be yet. We'll see. We'll see. So I'm going to end the vlog here and I'm going to show you guys putting the mask on and we might end the night with a movie. I was, um, I heard a lot of good things about the movie with Eddie Murphy. I think it's called Candy Cane Lane or something like that on Prime Video. So I heard good things about that. So I think I'm going to watch that movie to end the night and probably make a little cup of tea. And, you know, I feel like this whole video has just been like chill vibes, like not doing too much, you know, just chill vibes. So that's what we're going to do to end the night. But I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. If you did enjoy this content, go ahead and like, leave a comment, subscribe and share the video. So and join the community. If you did like the content, go ahead and comment and just say, hey, that's all I'm asking. Just say, hey, that's it. That's it. So if you enjoy the content, go ahead and comment, hey, like and subscribe the video and go ahead and share. And I will see you guys in the next video. Good night.